If you've forgotten your password, it's important to know how to remove it and regain access to your Samsung phone. There are several methods to do this, such as modifying settings or removing the lock screen. While effective, these methods carry risks, including potential data theft, time waste, and high costs. Therefore, we will share efficient and safe methods to help you quickly remove password from Samsung phone. If you know your screen lock password, you can easily remove it in settings. Firstly, go to settings on your Samsung mobile phone to delete the password from your phone, then scroll down to security and then device lock. Now click on the screen lock option available here, then a prompt will appear on your screen where you need to enter your password, then select the new screen lock, type none, and then click delete. These few simple steps will help you delete your password easily without performing any technical steps. Sometimes people forget the password of their Samsung phone which is very common among mobile users. If you are also in the same situation but want to regain access to your Samsung phone, don't worry, just keep watching. Find My Mobile would be a good solution for how to remove password in Samsung phone if you have a Samsung mobile. However, it won't work if your Samsung account isn't set up on your mobile phone. To state unlocking your Samsung mobile with Find My Mobile, start by tapping the device whose password you want to then select unlock and the process will let you remove the password from your Samsung mobile. The process will also wipe all the passwords on your mobile. If you are okay with that, Confirm your selection and log into your Samsung account when asked. By following these simple steps, you can unlock your Samsung device. Another efficient solution is to unlock your Samsung mobile with Find My Device. Previously, the solution was called Android Device Manager. To remove passwords on your Samsung device, you have to log into your registered Google account. Always remember that this option is a suitable solution for modern Samsung devices. However, you can access it through any Samsung device you have. Firstly, you need to turn the location on your Samsung mobile phone on, then connect your mobile phone with an active Wi-Fi connection. Now click on the Samsung device you need to unlock, then choose Erase Device and confirm your selected option. Now you can set up a new password for your mobile phone. After completing this process, you may lose some of your apps and photographs. However, you can restore these through your Google account if it contains a backup of your data. If Find My Device isn't showing your device, refresh the application or web page multiple times. Eventually, it will pick up your Samsung device. If your device lacks a Samsung or Google account, DroidKit can help. This app easily removes passwords from Samsung phones with just a few clicks. It works with over 20,000 brands, including Huawei, Xiaomi, Motorola, and Sony. Simply download the app and follow the easy steps to regain access to your device. Firstly, download DroidKit for free and launch the tool on your computer. Then click to enter screen unlock mode. On the Unlock screen page, read the instructions and click the Start button after connecting your Samsung device to the computer via a USB cable. After that DroidKit prepares the profile for your device, then click on Erase Now option. Then check Samsung to confirm the brand of your device. Now follow the on-screen instructions to put your Samsung phone into recovery mode and wipe the cached pattern on your phone. Now wait for a few minutes and you will see the screen lock removal completed page. DroidKit is a user-friendly software suitable for all professionals and beginners. It can remove password from Samsung phone, bypass FRP lock, fix system problems, and support recover permanently deleted data such as photos, videos, and contacts. Whatever the problem, DroidKit can solve it quickly. Thanks for watching if you found this video helpful. Please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. See you next time.